Hey, welcome to Quick Bites, where we're bringing tech science and entertainment news quick, fast, and swiftly. My name is Evan, let's dive in. As you may have heard by now, with the steadily changing climate, oceans are going through some dramatic changes. One of the more unfortunate changes is the health of coral reefs around the world. As you can see, what was once a vibrant and colorful coral reef is now slowly dying. But there is some good news. Scientists all around the globe are trying to find ways to bring back coral reefs and allow them to thrive just as they used to. In the Caribbean, researchers are cultivating coral nurseries that they can reimplant on degraded reefs. And in Hawaii, scientists are trying to breed corals to be more resilient to rising ocean temperatures. But here's a new, rather interesting potential solution. And it has to do with sound? Yes, British and Australian researchers are looking to broadcast sounds that only healthy coral reefs make inside dying ones to lure back sea life whose absence is the main cause of the reef's degrading health. This was all put to the test in a six-week experiment where researchers placed several underwater loudspeakers in dying patches of Australia's Great Barrier Reef and played recordings gathered from healthy reefs. And the results were actually pretty promising. But first, this episode is sponsored by Elk Products. Enhance your home with state-of-the-art security and automation control technology to make your home safer with more efficient energy management. Visit www.elkproducts.com for more. The study found that twice as many fish occupied the areas where the sounds were playing. Now you may be wondering, how does the presence of fish affect the health of coral? Well, the study's lead author, Timothy A.C. Gordon, explains that fish are a crucial part of coral reefs ability to function as a healthy ecosystem. And boosting the fish populations could help kickstart the natural recovery process and perhaps counteract the damage we're seeing from coral reefs around the world. You might also be wondering what kind of sounds healthy coral reefs make. Well, surprisingly, coral reefs are quite noisy. It's all the sound of crackling, snapping shrimp mixed with the blurp sounds that fish make that combine to make a beautifully epic sonata, very similar to what we heard at the famous Bubble Bowl halftime show. So can this actually solve the problem of dying coral reefs? Well, the researchers are cautiously optimistic. They say this should be viewed as a way to manage coral reefs and help keep them alive in the meantime. However, this is likely not a long-term solution. But luckily, many brilliant minds are going to work to tackle this issue from other angles as well. But we'd love to hear your thoughts on using sound to save coral reefs, so please let us know in the comments below.